Hey guys, you're watching Boondocking with Dennis. I'm watching Eugene. Eugene is watching the fisherman. Fisherman's watching the water. <laughs> we all have something to do. Very nice day. Nice breeze. Low mosquitoes. It's a good day to be in Rockport, Texas. Good morning, Luciano. Good morning. Hey, uh, well, you met the Hill family over at the donut shop. Oh, yeah. The mom, the dad, and the three kids. Uh, they gave me a gift card for you. So um, I put that in your envelope. And then a nice lady named Mary um, sent me money to give to you. So I put that in your envelope as well. Okay. So we just thank want. Thank you, Mary. Yeah, and thank the Hill family. Um, Hill. Hill family? Yeah, yeah. They're the ones you met at the donut yeah, shop. I met them, but I could never get their names straight. I, I, uh, uh, very, very nice people. Everyone oh, yeah. should wear name tags. Huh? Everyone should wear name tags. <laughs> nah, I still forget. How's, um, how are the mosquitoes? Uh, oh, they visit me every night and every morning. Yeah. Are, are they are they leaving you alone here? Oh yeah, it's too windy out here for them. Yeah, good, good. I gotta go make breakfast. I'm, I don't feel like I got eaten alive at Walmart last night. Yeah, I can imagine. Oh, we out there. But I I I I, I was waiting for curbside. Oh, that family was looking for you too. Oh, uh, when they saw you, they had already met me. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah, they, they were real nice. They, they sent me an email and let me know they were looking for me. So I just wanted to catch you and uh, make sure you knew you got some gifts in. All right, you have a good day, sir. Okay. Bye-bye. Bye. Hanging out in the shade and Eugene is giving me the side eye, keeping me company. I was talking to my buddy Brian. Brian said disco music was coming back. When I heard that, well, first I was afraid. I was petrified. <laughs> There's an obscure reference lost on the crowd. I stopped at the mail center and I had a big box from Amazon and it's got four different things in it. And it looks like they're all from our buddy Todd. Thank you, Todd. That is awesome. And there's four different notes, just in case they came in separate orders. At least I would know who it was from. But uh, here's two things I just kind of put together. And Todd's note for this one says, you got hosed from Todd Sweeney. And uh, for the nozzle, it says, enjoy your shower. Today's not the first, is it? No, it's not the first. But, um, this is awesome Todd because I have wanted this for a while and uh, when I go to campsites that have a water hookup I'll have a clean hose to fill up my uh, six gallon water jug uh, when I go over to the state park and then when I have a, a campsite I can just use this to you know do the dishes and uh, clean a few things so that is awesome so thank you very much Todd I greatly appreciate it and also in there uh, my thermos exploded I don't know what happened to it <laughs> I, uh, I I had to force the lid off it was it was a mess uh, but this is a uh, food jar food container insulated and this says uh, enjoy your lunch from Todd Sweeney nothing in there yet but uh, yeah, I, I use this almost every day. So thank you, Todd. And then uh, one more thing. This is a, this is a box of pra practicality, all things I needed. And it says, uh, enjoy your pan, man. And this is my uh, Coleman fry pan with the folding arm. These things are awesome. And uh, it fits into my food bag uh, much easier. So, Todd, thank you very much. I appreciate the humor, and uh, I appreciate you, amigo. 
and uh, I'll be all ready to burn some food on this. I'm heading over to Goose Island State Park to use the shower. And we got some buddies hanging out here. He's a good boy. Good girl, I'm sorry. What am I thinking? <laughs> Hey, baby. I wish you were a little bit more afraid of people. And then right over here, we got one. Beautiful one. And there's a truck coming up behind us, so that's all the deer we get today. I always go real slow through here because they love to run out in front of my truck. I remember in uh, eastern Oklahoma up in the mountains, elk ran out in front of my truck. I was probably going about 70 and probably came within about two inches of clipping it. Here's a bunch more of the herd. Uh, we see them just as you're about to enter Goose Island State Park. I don't always see them. I often see them. That is private property, by the way. I, I watch other people's videos and I see them just going up the neighbor's driveway to film deer. Not cool, people. There's just deer everywhere today in the park and outside of the park. And there's been groups that I haven't filmed because I was filling up my water jug. Aren't they pretty? I wish you guys tasted better. <laughs> I just like seeing the deer. Sometimes you come here, you'll see 50. Sometimes you come here, You'll see nothing. There's a bunch more over here. This is one of the primitive campground areas. There's lots of deer chilling out. Not a whole lot of people. Matter of fact, there isn't a tent in this whole section. But lots of deer. And here's the uh, reservation board. And they're all wide open all available just coming out of the shower area I see deer down here now I don't think I've ever seen deer along here I actually thought that one sign was a deer <laughs> same color yeah I guess they're kind of used to people They don't know whether to take off running or to hang out to get a snack. Good morning. <laughs> they are beautiful. Bye bye. I see a pair of cardinals in there. The red one is a male and the blood olive one is a female. That's up in the branches there. I don't know if the camera will pick it up, but springtime couples therapy. <laughs> they have a little water fountain there, if you will. I believe it's spring fed. I'm not 100% positive, but it's just a trickle, but provides a nice little bird bath for the couple. I have seen so many deer in and around the park today that I actually stopped filming deer. <laughs> I'm like, okay, enough of the deer already. I want to apologize for that last segment. Um, I was waiting for the female cardinal to drop down to the little fountain there. And she had already done it and I didn't notice it until halfway through the video. So. When I went back and rewatched it, I kind of zoomed it in just so you could see the female and male cardinal a little bit better. That's a cool looking little pop-up, huh? That's different. I've never seen one like that before. It looks pretty cool. That is not the traditional pop-up. Pretty neat. But, um, yeah, I uh, totally miss the female dropping down. 
and I don't want to jinx this guys but I've only seen a few mosquitoes here and two days ago at Rockport in Rockport I was getting swarmed I uh, mentioned it when I did a curbside pickup at Walmart I got swarmed so far so good today I can't tell if that's cloud cover or more of our gift from Mexico <laughs> wildfire smoke As far as I know, Goose Island State Park might be the only park that offers wooded sites as well as sites right here on the bay, which is pretty neat. That's Aransas Bay over there, and on the other side of the causeway is Copano Bay, and around the corner is San Antonio Bay. So it's in a great location. The wildlife refuge is nearby. Uh, if you're in a state park, you don't need a fishing license. And if you don't have your own gear, you can even ask to borrow some gear right here at the ranger station. It's uh, on a first come first serve availability, but if you're not a fisherman but want to pretend you are for a while, <laughs> yeah, you might as well give it a try. You get one of these sights right on the water, and I'm sure you'll get more wind and less mosquitoes. It's actually supposed to clear up later tonight, so we might get a sunset. You can see people right up here have a, a few lines in the water. I don't know if here in the state park they have a maximum amount of lines you could set or not. Here's a casita. A casita always makes me think of uh, Rusty 78609. Back in the early days. I think that was the second rig he got after I started watching him. Well guys, I might be back with a sunset, either way, thanks for riding along today, thanks for watching. Thank you.